do i clash i feel like i i'm doing a whole bunch of clashing i'm trying to do like a fall movement talking today's video <laughs> I didn't even do an intro. You need to calm down. What's poppin' party, people? It's your girl, J Dog. The clap, it's not necessary. It's just not. What's poppin' party, people? It's your girl, J Dog. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new, welcome. My name is Jalen. You can just call me J Dog. So for today's video, we have my spooky Halloween decor collection, and I'm pumped. This is one of my favorite times of the year, this time and Christmas. I just love the vibes. I don't I don't know exactly what it is. I can't explain it, but it's the vibes. You feel me on that? The vibes? This outfit, I don't know what's going on today. Like, I was just like, I first put, put on the shirt, some sweats, was feeling it. I said, yes, I love that. Then I put on this necklace, and then I was like, I need more. So I put on this necklace, and then I was like, yes. And then I was like, wait, no. Okay, anyway, keeps cutting me off. I put on this beanie, and I was like, you know what? I like it. I'm feeling it. But then I was wearing a short sleeve shirt with a beanie. Isn't that a little weird? How does it look without? Actually, this is cute. I should leave it like this. This is cute. I think with this, it's just a little weird. It just seems a little bulky, a little too... Yeah, I think we're going to take this off. Sorry about that. Perfect, right? I don't know. I feel like it's weird. Now I feel like I just need to take off the beanie. Something is off, and I, I don't know what it is. Anyway, I like I said, today's video is my spooky Halloween decor collection, and I'm so pumped. I love Halloween. I love Christmas. The vibes are there for me. Check, 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 check. It's just a whole bunch of happiness, in my opinion. I also like Thanksgiving. I love to murk some food as well. I love that. But, but Christmas and Halloween are definitely my favorite. I, I don't know. No specific reason. I just love the vibes. But anyway let's get right into my halloween decor collection i filmed this video a couple times already but i keep forgetting to put stuff in it so i would go and film it and then remember oh you forgot to put this little spooky halloween decor in it so i've redone it a couple times this one's the solid one i can feel it in my bones this is the one that you guys are watching i can feel it deep down dude the beanie is it is it okay do i need to take the beanie off completely over it Anyway, guys, I'm getting a little worked up. Anyway, let's let's just get right into this video because I'm super pumped to share with you guys all my Halloween decor. I keep my Halloween decor up all year round, 24-7. It never goes away, and I love that. And when I move, it's going to be even more intense because right now we don't really have the room. I got one shoe, please. We about to get in on. Okay, so I'm going to start with my comfy stuff over here just so that I don't forget it. Um, my fiance was so sweet. I've been having a really rough 2020. So he decided the other day to go to the Walmarts and he went off. Actually, I forgot a sweater. I don't know where that's at at all though. Okay, so I got a sweater. It's not really Halloween, but kind of sort of. It's full on orange, but that's it. So it's like it feels Halloween to me because it's orange, but there's nothing that will tell you this is a spooky sweater you feel me so he got me that i don't know where it's at but it's somewhere he also got me a pj set so these ones just have like a little bit of orange on the bottoms there's some little shorts they're super comfy and i love them and he got me this shirt and i was like he he went and did this all on his own like he came back with like 12 candles with like he got some little a little he got little caesar's pizza he got those little cookies, the little sugar cookies, you know what I'm talking about? The little festive ones. He brought those. He got, well, he got Twilight, like all five Twilights. What? He went off. He went off, you guys. He brought me a Dutch Bros coffee. Like, this is all one trip party, people. I was like, you didn't have to do that. You really didn't have to do all of that. So he brought this back to him. Says, uh, you glow girl you glow girl and you know you know if you watch my channel you know your girl loves to glow we got the whole glowing movement today every day we got it going every day so it's you glow girl and it's a whole halloween movement like yes 100 percent. yes he knows me so well got that from walmart by the way walmart really be stepping it up just a little bit okay and then i got this pillow from marshall's either marshall's or tj maxx i'm not really sure but it's kind of the same thing yeah, I don't have the tag on anymore, but this is beautiful, and it's got little lashes. I thought that was so cute. I love my lashes. I'm obsessed with them, so I, I couldn't pass this up, and it's a spooky movement, so I was like, you know what? And it's got, look at, look at, oh, 
it's got little spider webs on the back how cute is that pillow it's just it can't get any cuter than that okay so i have two blankets and i'm pretty positive i got both of these from marshall's i know for sure i got this one but i'm not positive about this one so this one just has again a whole bunch of spooky movements on it it has a bat some spider webs an owl some candy um spy did i say spider webs i think i did um uh, it says boo has a whole bunch of like spooky words halloween trick-or-treat all that good stuff i've seen it and i had to get it i had another spooky blanket and um we were on a trip somewhere i think it was so i I don't even remember but i think i left it in like idaho or something we stayed in a hotel and i left it i was so upset i was like it was like my favorite blanket it was all black and then it had like um gold not gold it had like silver bats on it all over and it was so cute and i loved it so i didn't need another blanket but i was like you know what you lost your old spooky blanket you gotta get a new one so i got that one and then this one i don't really know what this is actually it's a little worn out trick or treat we got some bats some pumpkins some ghosts um yeah it's, it's a little bit worn out you can kind of actually you can see it pretty good in the camera a witch hat you can actually see it so much better in the camera a pumpkin it's so cute it's orange it's so cute okay that's what we got for comfy movements i'm pretty sure i have everything i still feel like i'm forgetting something but this time i don't care this time it's going up period i don't care okay um so now we're gonna start on like actual decor decor like stuff you hang up and like you put out and stuff so i'll start over here first so i got i got this um this picture from marshall's it was 7.99 i have the tag on it still i keep i literally like i said i keep this up year round it says if you've got it haunt it so cute i have like a whole bunch of picture frames over here and i i just they're just there there's my house is so small there's nowhere else to put it like if you were like oh i'm just gonna put my halloween decor away until it's halloween again you can't you can't do that where are you putting it so I just keep them up all year round. And then in the background, I have this in every single video. I love her to death. I was on a hunt. I was on the freaking lookout for this guy. I looked everywhere. I looked at Big Lots, which is like one of my favorite places to go for Halloween decor. I looked at um, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Ross, uh, Walmart, everywhere. And I was looking specifically for a pumpkin, like a little jack-o'-lantern wax melt that's what she is back there a little wax melt i was looking everywhere for it and then i finally was like dude amazon you freak it's hard check on amazon i checked on amazon and there she was i looked um about a week ago or maybe maybe even two weeks ago um when i filmed this video the first time and they didn't have any more in stock so hopefully hopefully they get it together and restock because it's important in case y'all like that which why would you not why would you not i get comments actually I get pretty um, frequent comments about my little jack-o'-lantern back there, and I love it. A little wax melt, like, it's, what? She's so cute. <sighs> okay, anyway, I think, I think it was like 20 bucks, which isn't that bad. I think it's cute. I think it's worth it. Okay, so I got these the other day. It was actually after I filmed the first two videos, so I'm actually kind of glad that I messed up on the first two and missed so many things, because I have to show you guys this. It's a uh, little, what's it called, an oven mitt? what what i got it from rayleigh's it's so cute i had to get it i could not get it and then i got up to the front and there was no tag on it and they were like uh i thought they're gonna be like sorry can't buy it. i was about to be like um how do you mean how do you mean so she's like how about 3.99 can i just give it to you for 3.99 and i was like yes it was probably more than 3.99 because it came with this too so i got it for 3.99 happy haunting it's so cute and i don't the only other oven mitt that i have is a christmas one and i got it from the 99 cent store and it was like really oh you scared the crap out of me i thought i was about to get killed right now um i lost all train of thought now i thought i was just about to die um oh it was a sparkly one from the 99 cent store or the dollar store and um it just i don't know it just isn't working for me it's like it's okay but like the sparkles 
really annoyed me really really bad so i got this one there's no sparkles i love that look at this she's so festive and cute oh my god i can't can't so cute okay moving on so this is another thing that my fiance went and got that day that i was just talking about where he went and brought me a whole bunch of stuff from like walmart dutch bros the little caesars movement he got me this too I, and I, i'm just obsessed with it i wanted to use it for my coffee but he said that I probably shouldn't um, just because the glass is really thin. I don't know, like burn my hand or I'm not really sure. But so I just been drinking like soda and like water in it. But isn't it so cute? The dollar the dollar store Walmart, you guys Walmart. I love it. I love it. It is just like spooky it's so spooky and cute oh my gosh everything's spooky i just can't with marshall's mo mostly marshall's marshall's usually goes off on halloween decor this year i don't know what happened um with the halloween decor if it's like covid said no or i don't like they're like trying to be like oh if you sell if you sell stuff, people are gonna decorate and then they think it's okay to go trick-or-treating. I don't really know what happened, but there was like nothing really this year. And it kind of bums me out a little bit because I love that time of the year to go to Marshall's and just see a whole section of Halloween decor. Even if you don't buy anything, just to look at it is fun. But they said no, I guess they said no. Okay, so keeping it on the skull train, I guess I got I got this from the 99 cent store. It's a little skull. This is one of the things that I forgot in the first video that I did. I got this from the 99 cent store. What? I know, isn't it so cool? It's really glittery. That's the only thing that kind of is annoying. But other than that, it's so, it changes. What? I think it's so cool. Okay, so next I have this little candy bowl that I got from, hmm, I think I got this at the 99 cent store too. I think that was the same trip that I got that. Pretty sure. Pretty sure I got this from the 99 cent store. I think it's just a little cute bowl. Um, so I just filled it up with candy the other day, but usually we have like really random stuff in it, like batteries and like mints. <laughs> just a whole bunch of random stuff. So again, we keep her up all year round. Currently, she's got some candy in there or whatever. We're almost, we're almost done already. How sad. How sad. Okay, so I actually got these, actually probably like last month or so, I got all excited for the festivities, the festivities movements and whatever. So I got these socks, which I usually don't do this. I usually wear black socks, period. Like I look like a gothic queen today. Black on black on black on black. But anyway. Yeah, I usually wear black socks, that's it, period. Like, no, like, little designs anymore. In high school, I would wear, like, one pink sock with, like, yellow stripes and then another, like, orange sock with, like, polka dots. So, I don't, it's kind of different that I picked these up, but I seen them and I was like, Halloween, here I come. I'm getting them. So, I think it was a 10-pack from Marshalls. I just grabbed a couple of them. So, this one has, like, little pumpkins on it. This one has pumpkins on it again with a little dog, which is really random. Some more, more pumpkin-y movements. Another dog that I, that I don't own. But I thought they were cute, so I grabbed them anyway. Um, I've worn them probably like three times so far. <laughs> so I probably shouldn't have gotten them, but I seen them. I said, spooky vibes, here we come. I have to get them. I, I did not need to get them, but I think they were like $6.99, somewhere around there, which is pretty good. But I just wear black socks, so I was like, J Dog, why? This was an impulsive buy. You didn't need to do this at all. But anyway, anyway, it's not that important. Okay, so we're almost done. I feel like I'm forgetting stuff. Oh, okay, before I forget, I have this little bat necklace that I got from Sheen. I thought when I was first, like when I first seen it, went to go buy it, I was a little skeptical because I thought that it was gonna be like huge. And this the size that it is, is so perfect. I just thought it was going to be, like, really, really big. And I was like, uh, I don't know. I, like, if it was a little dainty movement, definitely would buy it. But I'm not sure. Like, the way that it looked in the picture, it just looked really big. So, thank God she came out like this because I love it. And I just, for, like, $2 from the Sheen 
she can stay is having the deals. I actually posted this in a haul. So if you want to check out that whole haul that I posted, you should do that. And I'll have the link down below if you're interested. Um, but anyway, okay, this is another thing that I forgot in my first two videos I got, which they're all mumble jumbled up and I'm not, I'm just not dealing, dealing with it right now. I'm not. So I got these from, actually, do they work? Nope, there's no batteries. So you have this little thing right here and you got to put some batteries in there. Um, but they're just little lights. These ones are bats. And I thought that I had pumpkins but i don't i might have thrown them away i'm not really sure but um and then these ones are just purple lights and i think the bats are purple and i have these purple lights and then um i got these orange lights to go along with the pumpkins because they're orange you know and then i have like a um a bulletin board that i used to like deck put this like all around the bulletin board around um like halloween whatever whatever the fall movement all that good stuff but I haven't used them in a while. They're just a little bit extra. They fall a lot. Like these, like where do you put these? You know what I mean? They're just too big and bulky. And if you're trying to just like decorate something that's hanging up, you just have these like on the side hanging down. You know what I mean? So it's just like, I don't know. They would fall all the time. I was over it. I got them from Big Lots though, if you like those. Actually, was it Big Lots? It was either Big Lots or Party City. Actually, I think it was Party City. I'm not really sure. It was one of those two. I'm pretty sure either way, they probably both have those. But yeah. I also have orange lights that I have no idea where they're at. The last thing is my morning pumpkin mug. I love this mug. If this mug is clean, I'm using it, period. Period, I'm using it. And it's so cute. It's got a little pumpkin at the bottom that you get to see when you drink your coffee. I just think it's so cute, festive. And literally, again, like I said, I, I use all this stuff year round, so I love it. But yeah, I think that's all we got, I think. Hopefully we didn't forget anything this time. If I did, like I said, this is it. This is what we got next year. I'll try better. <laughs> I'll try harder next year. But anyway, guys, that's the end of this video. I did just post a giveaway up, and it's actually the video before this one. So make sure you go check that out. It's a pretty good one. It's a little fall giveaway movement, and I actually love it. I feel like the people love it. But anyway, if you want to enter that, all you have to do is show love. So you can start by commenting under this video if you would like. But you can show love by commenting. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Click the bell so you know when I post future videos. Make sure you stay tuned because I will be announcing the winner the last video in November. So make sure you're staying tuned, you're paying attention, all that good stuff because I'll, I'll be posting it. I'll be posting it on my channel. But you can add me on my Instagram, on my Snapchat, on my Twitter. Um, I don't have a TikTok currently, but I think I'm going to make one. But other than that, that's how you enter just by showing love in general. What I'll be looking for the most, though, is um, interaction here on my YouTube channel. So like I said, make sure you comment. You can start by commenting on this video. Go check out my fall giveaway. Comment under that video. All that good stuff. But anyway, that's the end of this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Comment below. Check to see my next video. And then I'll see you guys there.